welcome to a new installment of Mongolian Viking. Right now I've gotten a visit from three friends from Norway. They came yesterday to uh, UB or the city, to Ulaanbaatar, the capital. And, and right now we are going to South Gobi or Umengov, as it's called in Mongolian. Uh, Vega, the guy uh, behind me, he's the guy doing all of the editing for all of these videos. So big thank you to him. Ornat is an uh, older brother Hogna and uh, Björnar, a uh, random Norwegian where he came from, also joined us here. Now he's our friend from my home as well. Um, so we'll probably have some good landscapes, some good camping and look forward to taking you all with us. driving five hours from the city now approximately through uh, some green steppe and now in the desert and we're getting close to the white stupa which apparently is a uh, highly recommended uh, tourist viewpoint so we'll go and see what it is and yeah when we're done with this hopefully we'll have enough gas to get back to where we're sleeping uh, you never know but it's fun Yeah, we just got inside from uh, looking at the white stupa now. We're inside a car. It's insanely windy, so we couldn't do any filming outside. I didn't dare get my drone up, but I think a drone would get some really good shots from here. I think I got some good as well with my camera. But Vegar, the editor, he is insane, so he put his drone up and hopefully that will look awesome. town yesterday with a few lights blinking now it's on it was after dark couldn't find a restaurant so we ended up with some uh, homemade food or dry freeze food from uh, and a boiler at the hotel room so that was perfect and now we're off to Gor Great Gorban Sechen or Gorban Sechen National Park it's uh, yeah Highly recommended by tourist places. I've never been in this part of Mongolia before, so it's fun for me to see something new as well here. And we'll have the people here reading maps and doing photography and stuff. So that's good. Yeah, now we're heading up this gorge here. Apparently there's a place where the uh, ice never melts in the summer. It's 28 degrees outside, so that's quite impressive. If it stays mm, frozen the, through the summer. Uh, we've also seen a couple of signs uh, driven past them here that there's a lot of ibex and you're not allowed to kill them so hopefully we'll see some of those as well and um, yeah we, from here we'll go uh, further on to uh, some sand dunes and green pastures right next to each other so hopefully it makes for good photography today Yeah, now we've just got to camp, got some food here, so that's perfect. The sun is setting over the Mongolian desert, the Gobi Desert, of course. We had to go through some sand dunes here. Uh, it looked like it might be tough without airing down the tires, but we made it, so that's great. We got some good footage, but we'll head down tomorrow morning to get some even better, hopefully. 
So thanks for coming along and we'll enjoy some food here. <laughs>